counties. Now police say both cases are connected and tonight four people are facing charges. Thanks for joining us tonight at six. I'm Dan Spieler and I'm Aisha Hassani and for Fanchon tonight Fox 59's Alexis McAdams spoke exclusively with two of those suspects behind bars. Alexis. I sat down with one suspect here at the Madison County Jail who tells me he witnessed both of these murders but says he didn't pull the trigger and knows who did. I started to walk on down the trail and I heard pop. Pop. About that much time apart. And then here he comes running behind me saying, come on, come on, we gotta go. Tonight, Jordan Zirkle sits handcuffed behind bars at the Madison County Jail. He says he witnessed two murders, including 36-year-old David Phillips II, whose body was found in a wooded area in Anderson on Monday. I won't lie, I'm not completely 100% innocent because I did go with them. I did walk through the woods, but it was all in under fear. I was threatened to be shot in the head if I didn't go with and do this. Police didn't even know Phillips was missing. Someone tipped them off while they were investigating another case involving a missing woman whose body was found in Grant County today. Tonight, Zirkel, along with Taylor Wheeler, Brittany Vontris, and Daniel Jones all face murder charges in connection with the two cases. Investigators say witnesses identified Jones as the shooter in both homicides. He sat there and bragged that he would kill us if we was to say or do anything. We got innocent people about to go down for this that don't need to be going down. Tonight, deputies say they have the murder weapon and all suspects in custody. It's a story we'll continue to follow. In Anderson, I'm Alexis McAdams. Back to you. Tonight, an Indianapolis-based adult care company.